The Maisa Zayra by side. There, I want to discuss today about the Indian of Shaila, the Hashanah, the fact that, that we asked in Talamot to receive a different minig. Uh, right, here, that's like right, but the guy you should take December, right? right. December 4th or 5th or, 5th, or something. Yeah. First of all, interesting, Bechlal, yeah. Birchas Hashanim. Birchas Hashanim is the ninth bracha in Shmona in, in Esrei. Oh, yeah? Yeah. And the. Nine? Yeah. The, 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 the Gemara explains. The Gemara explains what's the reason why it was put in the ninth bracha, as the ninth bracha. It's because. The ninth parak in Tehillim, actually by us it's Yud, the Gemara says that's because the first two prakla of Tehillim are considered one. It right. starts with Ashrei, and it finishes with Ashrei. Ashrei, it starts Ashrei Ha'ish, and it finishes Ashrei Kol Chesibay. So it's really one parak of Tehillim. So the Maise, in the ninth parak of Tehillim, which is by us numbered Yud, the there is it discusses about those that are mafkiye shorim. Mafkiye shorim. In other words, it's still 150 kapitlach, right? But you're saying essentially it's an 149. That, wait, wait, but you're saying that the first kapitel and the second are considered one. Yeah. Who says this? I mean, where? It's a gemara. It's a gemara. Yeah, it's a gemara and Megill, I believe. Oh. Oh wow! The Gemara says this in Gemara. Yeah, Tessam, Abrachas, Tessam Abayz. Now, the in in the ninth capit in the tenth capital, which is the, the ninth, it says, "Shver Zraya Rasha, Hashem, you should break the arm of the Rasha." Does the Mafkiyah show him? Vera Tidrish Vishay Paltimsa. And when you're going to search out his evilness, you're not going to find it. What does this mean? Explains the Gemara earlier on, as the Pasuk says, this, this Russia, Yere ba Mr. Ka'arye, he, he waits and hide, he conceals himself in ambush like a lion. Besukai, in his hut. In his hut, Yere vlachtef oni, he waits in ambush to chapa oni. Yachtif Oni Bimashhe Brishte to happen Oni to pull him into his net. Says the Gemara, Ganovim don't chase after Aniim. They chase after the Ashim. They don't bother with the Aniim. Yeah. They, they have Ashim. There's very little crime rates in, in, in the poorest neighborhood. There's very little crime <laughs> Nothing rates. Nothing to steal. Nothing to steal. No. <laughs> the mice are there. Unless Class of Sham we visit. That's it. Someone just now from Westchester was talking to me the other day and they, they said, very low crime rate in Westchester. There's no reason for them to come to, to me. The next neighborhood over, that's the richer neighborhood. Oh. So even by the rich, it's, it's oh. hand which Madrega. So Lamaisa, he says the Gemara, this is referring to the Mafkish or those that raise up the prices when there are times when there's not as much food, not as much wheat. Then they, they, live, they find out an opportune time to lift up the price very high. Now who suffers from it poor the people. most? No, no. The poor people. The rich people say they have guilt and besides for that the rich people have their own fields and they have their own produce they have their own storages so for them it's not really an issue. So this when we're talking about that the Russia is waiting to ambush the Ani he's talking about the Mafki Yasham because that's the one who really hurts. So in the Gemara on the, later on when David Amalek says, Shvar Zayed Rasha, break the arm of the Rasha, it's referring to what it said a few psukim earlier, that Rasha, you should break his arm. What does it mean break his arm? Not literally break his arm, but make sure Hashem to give Soiva to the Velt, and if there'll be Soiva, there'll be plenty, they won't be able to lift the Mafki Yashyarim. And the Rechamela will be Shvar Zayed Rasha. And Varad Tidish Risha, when you're going to search out his, his, his Rishos, to find it because he had machshavas to be a uh, Russia. But Lepoyal, 
you, you didn't allow him to be a Russia mm-hmm. because you made sure that there was plenty to a Seva. Baal Timsa. You're not going to find oh, any Rishas Lepoil because you're going to preempt the whole thing. So Maisa, because this capital, the ninth capital, discusses the Ingen Seva <laughs> having plenty and having enough produce, so therefore they put Birchas Hashan in the ninth bracha. We see some type of kasher between the nine I don't know what the kasher is, between 9 and Teisha, the number 9, and the Ingen of Soiva having Birchas Hashanim, having a bracha, that the produce should be good. So that's why they bechlal Birchas Hashanim. Now why were they kevei of the same tal of matter to be shoyel for rain in Birchas Hashanim? Pasha, the Gemara explains, the Gemara in Brachas explains, because this is a place of Parnassah. This is where we're asking for Parnassah. Rain is how we get Parnassah. Yeah. So we ask for rain in Berch HaShanah. So Berch HaShanah is the ninth bracha because nine has to do with the capital Tehillim of Soiva and Sheila has to do with Berch HaShanah because they're both Parnassah. Now, What's going on after in, in the bracha in What's the Kavana? Now, Matzah? What? Matzah? 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 Matzah, matzah. Wheat for matzah? Oh, matzah. Pesach matzah, yes. Yeah, what? That's right. Yeah. And this was especially in the time when they had difficulties. Yeah, think of the Pesach matzah? Okay, yeah, it's been in okay. Okay. Today's days, we have Baruch Hashem, we have so many Yisroigim, that every one of us has a nicer Esrig than maybe the Rav and the Shtat had in Europe. <laughs> yeah, for sure. They barely had any Yisroigim there. They were calm, calm, happy. That it's uh, uh, one Esrik, they had an Esrik, I call, and we'll come bench an Esrik. So the Maise, say it wasn't like today, thousands of Esrik games, so much competition, and so we get all this beautiful Esrik. In those days also, they were not, the Yidin did not go down to Italy. It used to be the Goyim used to bring it to the port. Uh-huh. The Yidin would meet them far away at the port. Uh-huh. Really, the, the Italian Esrik of Marshall don't come from Yanev. Yanev is the... Uh, is the port that really come from Calabria. Calabria. Calabria is far away from the port. Calabria. Now, Lomaisa, we still keep, people still like to call Yanavit, that's the original name. Yeah. But the Lomaisa, the, the Sregan, did not go through Yanavit, we have planes and we're not going for shipping through this distant port. So, the, the, the guy would pick a Sregan, they knew how to pick a Sregan. <laughs> you have to be careful when you pick it off, the, the, the leaves are pricky. And they could poke in and make blood lach and everything. So now they didn't go down and they only pick the nicest ones off the tree. Lachatchila trying to pick the nicest. And, a, and they, wait, they know how to cut it off and pick it nicely down. But when the Goyim were taking it off, they weren't bucking in all the, the Hidurim to bring such nice Esraigim. So whatever you got, you got. And then how much was there? And it was traveling and shipping. It wasn't so packaged. So Maisa, the same thing with Matzis. There was difficult years for the produce. But Baruch Hashem today with shipments, if it's difficult, we're growing wheat here. We bring wheat from somewhere else. So these are not issues really. But that originally it says that you're supposed to have Kavana in Baruch Haleinu, not only for your private produce, but it's the same, the, the, the Tuvasa Latoiva, that our, our produce should be good, you used to have kavana that you should have matzah and wine and a sroigi and all that the produce should be good, you should be able to have all the mitzvahs. The mitzvahs. Where does it say that? This br- brings in a hayoim yoim from the Rebbe published. Yeah, brings it down from his father-in-law. Uh-huh. I don't know the, where the original source is. Uh-huh. Now, I'm sure it's said it somewhere. Wow. Now, in Eretz Yisrael and Eretz Yisrael, they need rain uh-huh. right away. They don't have much rain in Yisrael. Therefore, they start to ask for Kshamim. They really want to ask for Kshamim right away. Exactly. But the Allah is that on Sukkot itself, we're not going to be Shoyal because it's Simen Klala Bechag. Who wants to have rain on Sukkot? It's a Simen Klala. So we don't want to ask on Sukkot. We start to be Maskir, even Maskir, even to mention that Hashem is Mash of Ruach uh, We're not asking. We're just mentioning that Hashem as the Koyach. We wait. Until Shmini Atzeres, to say Mashiv Rocham and Agashim. Doesn't the Gemara say it's because they have to get home? Oh. and if you're down, it's going to be a flood. It's so why do we wait? If you, if you start Mashiv Rocham and Agashim on Shmini Atzeres and Isruchag, we should yeah. start already being shown. We start saying yeah. Bakhalena, ready yeah. to say Talmud Torah. Yeah, the yeah. Maisi is because of Avos Yisrael, people were Ulo Regal, 
and they took them time to go home until the furthest Yid got, went home from the river. to the river of Paras, the Euphrates yeah, River. Yeah. Took two weeks. A week and a half. If will two that weeks. Happen, that'll rain. The river will get so if we would, They'll be in blood then. If we would, if there would be rain, there would be hard for them to travel back yeah. home. So therefore we wait till the Achrin should be Yisrael, the last Yid gets home. The Rebbe one time brought out, you know, the grace of Limud. Over here you see that the whole Klal Yisrael is waiting. Who are they waiting for? The Achrin should be Yisrael. The Achrin should be Yisrael. The, the, the Achrin should be Yisrael that lives all the way there by Nahar Parah. So he gets home. It's we're not going to, even though we need rain, we're going to wait. Lamaisa said, dear friend, Yisrael, the first moment they could start is Ayin Chesh. Lamaisa and Bavel, they didn't need rain, need, need rain so early. There was rain in general. They had, and they had plenty of rivers there and everything. It wasn't such a big issue. So when did the season come when we actually need rain? They wait for 60 days after Tkufas Tishrei, after the equinox in Tishrei, 60 days later. That comes out, it's either December 4th or December 5th. We go by the Goisha date. The reason we're going by the Goisha date is because the, sum, the, the February solar has, year... December uh, 28th, December 29th. Depends how many days February has. Right. So that so depends on the Goisha calendar because we actually, the seasons go by the solar calendar depending on the sun. Our year goes by the lunar calendar. So we can't make cheshbins with the lunar calendar because the lunar calendar is not in sync with the solar calendar. That's why we add a Shalom Mubaris every few years to bring them in sync. Right, so so Lamaisa, so we went the solar year, the solar cheshbin of a solar year to 365 days has divided into four seasons. And we need, we need to ask for rain in this time, in the Tkufa, when rain is necessary, which is, start 60 days after, after, um, the, after the Tkufa. That means the first day of fall, 60 days later. What is the day of Tkufa? Anyone knows the English date? When the, when September 20th, 21st, depending. Yeah. It used to be... Or is it January well, it used 6th? To be the before, in December no. sometime. But uh, I don't know, one pope moved, no, to, moved no, the no. calendar. I, I, I will tell I you I thought that that's January interesting. You better go wait 10 days. No. No. no, that's, that's the new year. The new year. We're mixing up the new year. Heard that story? New year. No, you know, it's January and December that we start. No, no, not, not by the... March 20th, 21st, June 20th, 21st. But oh, wait, in other words, 20, just 21st, for a quick recap. I am not, I am not a bucket. No, but May Karu was supposed to ask on Sukkot. Is that the kind of idea? I want to just... No, that's Yisrael. That's Yisrael. And that's Yisrael. And they wait for the people to get home since two, what is it? Two, two weeks, weeks after Sukkot. Two weeks. Now, us, we do it according to Tkufa... Of what? Of Tishrei? 60 days after... After Tkufa's Tishrei. After after the first day and of why? Because that's when you need the rain in Chutzmaretz? Yes. That's when the rain is necessary in Bavel. In Bavel. But in Eretz Yisrael, they need it before. Why? Because they never have rain anyway. It's because like a since, problem all the time. Or what? Because since rain, since rain Eretz Yisrael is on mountains. On mountains. It's a mountainous region. So yeah. they don't have as much water yeah, and rain. Yeah. So they ask. Therefore, they ask, need to ask earlier. But in Bavel, yeah. there's a valley. So Bavel, there wasn't such an issue. So, so they why can wait. that time? Like, that's the time to go planting issue. out the plants. Oh, oh, so what? Oh. I'm trying to understand. So Chatsi Tishrei, they would start to plant. Uh-huh. It's a Zman Zera. Uh-huh. They plant. And you want to make sure it rains after that time because yeah. if it doesn't rain right away, the, the mice come and they eat up the the. the the, the but seeds. 60 days is not too late? 60 days after what? No, because after we can. We, we have time. We, we, they, they could plant and there's, rain, there's water anyways. There is water. However, when it comes 60 days, then at that point, it's, it's Mamash to Yemoysak Shaman. Yemoysak Shaman, winter time is the time of Yemoysak Shaman, when that's the time when the world it's gets rain. It's, it's but we don't, they don't need such a, lar, a long Yemoysak Shaman in Bavel. They don't need so much rain. It's okay, we, we all wait for the rain. So they don't need such a long. I will tell okay. you. Yeah. yeah. Now. You can take a let's take a look. We'll take a look inside. And then we'll see also, interestingly enough, we around the entire world, there's only two men hugging. Either you file, either we do either you narrate Israel, you do Zion Khajun. Yeah. Or the rest of the whole the rest of the entire world does Samach Yom Yom sixty days after Tkufa's Tishri. Yeah. 
We're by Achtas. When it comes the to the is, what is about Australia? Shaila is what happens to the southern hemisphere. Dominic's the southern right. hemisphere, the southern hemisphere, you know, Brazil, or Argentina, and then all these places. Oh, okay. In Australia, New Zealand, Uruguay, South have South an North. issue that there everything's the opposite. So what's going to be they, they they're asking the same talamotel of Rocha, the same time that we do, yeah. but that's their summer. Yeah. And their Mesak Shamim is after Pesach. Yeah. It's a punk Yeah. So what do you do? About so that? it's a shayla. They ask. This is already the Rishonim already yeah. discussed. The Rishonim, yeah, the Rishonim are already discussing this. The whole yeah. entire Southern Hemisphere. Has plus, an issue. Plus uh, oh, so let's take a look. So you go after to show everything, right? Let's take a look. Birchas Hashanim, Tzorich, Lishel, Bam, Matar, Mibes Hakshamim. We said a lot of this, we spoke out loud, but we'll see it inside. Tzorich, Lishel, Matar, Mibes Hakshamim. You need to ask during the winter time for rain. Why were they kiveya to ask during Birchas Hashanim? Tzorich, Shehi, Parnasa, Kvot, Birchas Hashanim. We need rain is Parnasa, so they put in the bracha to discuss the Parnasa. Maschil lishal vayt sir melel zayin macheshen lefi she eretz harim mitzrich lekshamim miyad achar chag vayroi lishal b'miyad achar chag sheikra hashayla tetzva v'yom emachar chag tishigia achin shiv yisrael shal ol lered al basin lahar pros shumakim yishav ayoyser roch mishalayim and that time was the furthest settlement away from mishalayim. The, the Geshem won't hold back his trip. I now, we no longer have this issue, so maybe we should start asking Yisrochag. We don't have any more the issue of, of Eul Regal. They will continue to gather like they do till today. They were still Eul Regal. They I couldn't bring carbon, but they were still Eul Regal. They didn't felt bad all the years where the red girl now in Alabama. They used to come. I think I think it's in the Rishayim. They're still in India. The fear of a bad Lord that can't ask Chachamim should take no shabbos of life. Right out the Rebbe Shachanarich. Right out the Rebbe Shachanarich. Up to that day, there were still people used to gather in Eil Regal. So therefore, the Takana wasn't bottled. So the Ma'is that remained, the date of Zion Cheshur remained. Over Bavel, the Chayetzeba, in in Bavel and similar areas. Sha'in Eretz Harim Kert Yisrael. It's not a mountainous region like Eretz Yisrael. Main Tzarech L'Kshamim Miyad Achar Chag. We don't need Kshamim right after the, the Yom Tif. Maschilim Belel Samach Achar Tkufas Tishrei. The 60th night after Tishrei. V'yoy Matkufa V'yoy Mashayel V'chol Al Samach. You count the day of the Tkufa and the day that you're asking. The 60th day, it's all part of the 60 days. It's not in between, it's including the both days. There's always a two-day difference between Tkufa and the day that you ask the Shailah. If the Tkufa came out on Sunday, then the Shailah is going to be on a, on a Tuesday night. Even if the Tkufa came out during the daytime, the exact moment came out during the day, there's exact minutes, hours and minutes for the, the Tkufa. For Tkufas. Still in all, we start asking for the night of that day. The night before Aesis. Right? So the day, uh, even if the Tkufa only the the... the, the we said two days after. It's not a 40 so complete, it's not 60 complete, 60 24 hour period days. The first day could be missing. Let's say the Tkufa only started during the daytime. The Tkufa, when the season starts, could be during the daytime. That when the season starts, the Tkufa. But still in all, you're going to start that, that, you're counting that day as part of the 60 days. Even it's not a complete 60 days because you didn't have the night before. But it's 59 it's, and a half. It's and a half but you have, so that's 60 days. It doesn't have to be Samach Yom Eis You understand? The first day, the Yom Kufa, yeah. doesn't start from the first minute of the day. The Tkufa works by Cheshboyne's calculations. It could be in the middle of the day, like the Moilid, you know, like it's the Lakhana. So, so the the Shemesh, when you want a Machashev, the, 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 the Tkufa, 
It's the, it's not exact. It's not an even. It could be in the middle of the day. Because 365 into 4 doesn't work out to be exactly the thing. It's six hours. If it's a leap year, it's another 12, another six hours, nothing more. So it doesn't work exact. out mathematically. Yeah. Now, Va'anu, what is our minute? Isn't in English always like December something? December yeah. 4th or 5th? December 4th. Oh, so that's yeah. why it's 4th or 5th, because it depends course. on that. It doesn't change. If we would go by the by Levon, by by our by our cheshbin, it will change. It's not going to always be right. in the right time. But we have to go sun, by the solar, by the sun. The Goyish accounting goes by the sun. So that's it's either four or five. Yeah. Wait, I don't understand what he says. It's six from the Yom Hatufi, You can't sixty days, including that day of the Yom. Okay, I understand. But then he says Yom Hashela is two days later. Yeah. 60 days and then or 59 however you can't you know whatever and then two days after that is the shayla in the shmanas right why is that no i'm trying to understand what the question says. is why two days later why don't you just say 62 days later I'm sorry, I'm sorry, why don't you just say 62 days later because in a how it works out mathematically with the with the with the solar opposed to the moon the equinox is that the, is that the answer or? Why don't we just word it as as sixty two? Then you have the same thing. It's you have to say sixty two without counting the days. It's sixty with the days. Sixty maybe is a chosh, but it's two months maybe. It's a chosh, but I think. Oh, it's, maybe the gemara says. The, maybe the gemara says sixty it's even days, number. and he's explaining that it's actually two now, days. Now, anu us menogenu our minik. The Menei Bavel. We do like Menei Bavel. Bechol Makim and Bechol Makim in the world. We do Menei Bavel. V'yei Shetamu Bechol Kaza. There are those, and this the main one is the Rosh. The Rosh, and, and it has a Tshuva on it. And Bechol Kaza, they don't understand. Afshan Ohoel Chem Achach Mei Bavel. We turn the page, the second line. Mechol Makim and we always, our halacha is, we always follow Tama Bavli. We follow Bavl. Tama Bavli is the Iker compared to Yashami. We follow Bavl. We follow Yani Bavl. And the Lamaise, that makes sense when it comes to halacha issues. When it comes to Shiloh, when we need Kshamim, it's a Metzias. It's a fact when we need Kshamim. What does it mean? Well, yeah. We're Nayig like Bavl. Mm-hmm. Doesn't have any, make any sense. In Bavl, they needed rain 60 days. We need rain earlier. So if you don't live in a place that's like Bavl, so why are we still copying Bavl? It doesn't make sense to copy Bavl like in issues that are metzius, that are that up to the fact. The Here we have rain all the time. Okay, but there are other locations in the world that, oh, you yeah. know. Yeah. So when you find that there's a machalikas in between chachme Bavl and chachme Bavl, between Talmud Bavl and Talmud Yerushalmi, okay. we always say that they should Talmud Bavl the we follow Talmud Bavl the Iker. Zau says the Rosh, but Dvar is of a heter, Chiyav a potter, the tomb of a tara, but Dvar atoli b'tzayr a chasha. Something which depends on when you need it. Ain by shini lavol divrei Torah, roi leilach achar hashonim v'amakoymis v'amazman. Shabavol shechenes amayim rabbin. Bavol has a lot of water. Mitzarach l'ksham at samach l'tkufa till six days after the tkufa. Or there was a different Hezbo, says the Alter Rebbe. That the time of planting was later in Babel. So they need the rain earlier. The planting season was later. And these countries, when we start planting from when half the month of Tishri goes through. They're going to eat it all up. The farmers know. At least let's be like Eretz Yisrael. Maybe we should do right after Yom Tif. But okay, you don't want to go that far. Let's follow Eretz Yisrael. Why are we taking a minute bubble? There's no machloikis between the two of them, really. It's just a machloikis. The fact that bubble does... Bubble did 60 days. And Eretz Yisrael did Zayim Is that a machloikis? Different opinion, not different opinions. But they are just also tell you in Bnei Bavli you have to do like that. Bnei Bavli tells you you have to do like that. It depends on the place where you live. 
Sheidin way lo tam lo dreim shalei lasu kach. Ve lo meis tam shalei lasu And it's not pshat that each one is saying you have to do like me. And the shiba babla is it could be a tzarich lam. The right to smell. It's a tzarich lam. Where you are. Exactly. V'chein b'chol eretz shirach v'sidayim. Every land, which any big land. Maybe means not mountainous. I'm just taking a stab. No, but Rachel means you have to judge every land by. You can't judge every little place, judge yeah. every country, every region. Yeah. Rachel I'm not going to say every little island, every little spot should start being conveyed their own zma. Oh, oh, you mean the major land blocks yeah. of the uh, continents. Of Chora, like, uh, that's what he means. Actually, Rachel yeah. yeah. a big region. Yeah. Uh-huh. You should do what's right for everyone. I feel this should shama We should even should ask Meitzah Chama in the summertime. South America, you said. In Tzrichim, uh, That's South America. Okay. Yeah. Sorry, Rachel, you said the Rachel Sidaim Then he goes on. Now, now, uh, before we, 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 let's just skip this middle paragraph. We can get back to it. But let's go back on the Ingen Halacha. Loi niskabla svarazu. The svar is not niskabel. The rush is svar. The rush himself, by the way, says that even though I feel strong this way, I see no way out. But my chaverim were not agreeing to me. The oil doesn't. No one does this. Uh-huh. Wow. So he shekvar no gumi oilam b'chol tvutzes Yisrael shabachos l'art leila chachar me bavul So. Basically, this is the Nakoda saying, and we'll go back to the, the previous paragraph the, now. But Lamaise, it's very, very difficult to understand it. What is the Swara behind this? What can possibly be the Swara? We're doing something which doesn't make sense. I like it says before, and, by Shimi Labra, the great and I want to tell you something in all, could, poskim, in all the Paskim. In all the Paskim, this is very interesting. In all the Paskim, yeah. you find the Koyach of the Minig and everything. No one. No one says a proper svara why we should do differently. Oh, but this is just a fact. The oh, fact man. is that the Rambam, it seems from the Rambam, the Rif, and, and the Rosh himself says, and everyone, and that's it. Everyone bowed their heads. And do it, but we don't really have any real reason. Look, the Altarebbe says a whole ten lines over here yeah, yeah. to tell you that this makes the most sense. But Afo became. Wow, that's heavy. There even was one time in Toshim and Beis when the Rebbe said a Sikha. It was it was Hamisha Asa Ba'av, Tesva Ba'av, and then the Gemara says that the nights start to get short, longer, longer. 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 The days get shorter. Right? Yeah. The days get shorter. The nights are getting longer. Yeah. So those days, it wasn't like today where you know you stay, you, you, your working hours stay the same. We, they work based on the on the when the sun and the sun. So if now night is 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 coming in earlier, it's becoming night earlier. The doors are getting shorter, so you go home earlier. You don't stay at night at work. You don't have lights on the street. When does that start? Two bav. Yeah, yeah. by the night of two bav, around night of two bav is when it starts. So the Gemara says, "You should moisef for the Torah." So the Rebbe asked the Shail over there, "What about in the southern hemisphere when it's pulling five carat? On Taz for bav is when their nights are getting uh, uh, shorter. The days are getting longer because two bav is starting their summer. Yeah. Their summer, their spring and summer is when we're having our fall and winter. So it's pulling lahafich." Yeah. So the whole Gemara, which says, you have to be Moisif and Torah, and, and if you're not Moisif, it's a big Oynish, and if you're Moisif, you get a big Bracha and everything. So what should they do? So the Rebbe says, connects it to this whole discussion here, about that we still do, like, about this Machloikism here, when should you be, when should we be showing Kshamim in places that need Kshamim earlier? We still go like Bavl. So Vadir and the Sicha, Somehow it seemed that the because Rebbe was night. The Rebbe was night. They, they couldn't work in the dark. Only stay in the house with the candle and learn. It's a practical thing. Yeah. They, they're going to be battling hours with nothing. The Rebbe was night. That's right. The Rebbe was night in that sicha, that the svar of the rush, that really every place should do the way it. Uh, so the say, you know. Uh, had the Bachem Ar, the Rebbe says something, it's, it's right away, you yeah, know. Yeah, right. So the Bachem in Australia, Australia, they were hearing the Sicha on a hookup, yeah. and they right away said, seems like the Rebbe wants us to change, and uh, we in Southern Hemisphere, <laughs> we should be saying, uh, the saying yeah. Talamat, the Lavrache. Yeah, the Rebbe comes summer, while we have winter. That's yeah, so we should switch. Even yeah. though it's uh, summer. 
No, no the half here. over there, that's the way it is. They do very strange. And there's some of the same with St. Talmud, St. Talmud. It's very modern. We are now starting to say the St. Talmud. They just started right? summer. Huh? We're starting In a month, to... we're going to be starting to say. They started summer now. They're going soon for, for summer camp. Right. And they're going to be saying the St. Talmud like it's the middle of the winter. They're asking for a little... Like we said earlier, like, the Skabla We always do like bubble. They, they the whole world goes like bubble. I read the Sikha Tashman Bay. It doesn't seem to me like the Rebbe says this way and that way. He leaves it up for the open. It doesn't seem, but Al Kopane, maybe the Sikha wasn't written down exactly the way the Rebbe said it, or the Bacham somehow, or the Roland understood it. I don't understand. Well, Maisa, the Shaila Kasha from Maisa, I heard the Bacham over there in Australia heard it. They started to change. The next feel already, they started to change. It should have a groaner, a big groaner, all of a shalom from Australia was the Rav there and the Shliach of the Rebbe over there. And he came, he wasn't there like by the Sikha, whatever. Well, he came the next fila and he was he went Meshuggah, but they're trying to change the minig over here. The whole all the Klai, we everyone knows in the whole Australia, we do like Babba we do like everyone else the Chutzlar. He doesn't make sense, doesn't make sense. With the Skabu Svarazu, we we know you like the whole So the Maisa they right away call up his brother, the Blaiba Groner the Rebbe's mask here and said So the kids said the Rebbe said uh, the Rebbe sent back a message he never meant to change the minig. He uh-huh. meant an ingin, it makes the most sense. An ingin, conceptually. But, Taka, later on, later on, there was a clear sicha, like a few weeks later, the Rebbe said, this that I spoke then, I didn't mean to change minhagim, and you have to keep the minig, i exactly the way it is. And the Rosh himself said that the svar is not the scabble. The year the Rebbe does want to add a little uh, a svara. How could it be that we're asking for something which it's not lefi amokim? In the winter time, they're not asking, but in the summer they're asking. It doesn't make sense. Following? No, but the Adsim Sikha was about learning Torah at night. I, but he I connected that it. Point. No, but, so I don't understand. What's the question? Over there, it's daylight by them more. Not like by us, right? They so have it's a daylight. problem. There's more daylight means that there's less night. So, so, so no, since so our piece of our bit. They, it's, they don't have to be ma- more learning because they could work in the field. I mean, I'm going to this man of Chazal. 100%, right? was, 100%, but the Rebbe just connected it's, it's it. It's not, it's not a... It's not 100% a schlecht, condemn, but he so connected it. I mean, no, no. Yeah. But the connection, the thing yeah. is, like, similar to what we find over here. You see a cancer, we do something that doesn't make any sense, but we're knowing, like, play bubble. So he wanted Maybe to over say there. that they should learn Tyra also. He didn't say either way. Outside. Yeah, but still be mice if he wants. Maybe there's an English. Should be mice because we uh, we don't look at the way that uh, 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 waits by them. Uh, we look up in a bubble. Uh-huh, but you mean he stressed the point of it not making sense so much that the Bachram said, "Let's well, take a change." That's that, what it seems that's like. That's something that happened. That seems like it, I looked in the sicha. To, they, to me, to me, it doesn't the seem the Rebbe, Rebbe just spoke. left it open. He oh, said, they "It's a shakotai back and forth." I don't know how they understood. Maybe because of the rush. Maybe because when Rebbe mentioned the rush, so they thought Rebbe mentioned the rush. He's saying it's open for interpretation, even though the rush says the whole world doesn't do like I do. They left. So maybe the rush. Yeah, the fact that the Rebbe wasn't being clear 100% uh-huh. Uh-huh. and taking a chra, uh-huh. maybe uh-huh. the So the Maisa, yeah. they right away were told, Haltzach and the Rabbin, and, 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 and you nice got to do it the way the Minigam Akim is. saying the Rebbe did say a reason in that second sicha. Oh, in the second sicha, the Rebbe that. gave a shtikol hasbara. Okay. Shtikol hasbara. He said the Gemara yeah. brings down of Chanina ben Doisa when was going home, and it was traveling, and it was coming, going, and traveling home, and it was raining. Right. So he said... Everyone else, everyone in the world, Chanina, 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 Bincha, Lashem was over there. Bebetzar. Everyone is so happy with rain, but I'm traveling. Uh, I don't enjoy the rain, so the rain stopped. Chanina Gedoisa came home. She dived into the Eved. She said, "Rebbeinu Shalom." She said, "Call the Eved, call the Bebetzar." For Chanina, Chanina, Beni, Benachas. It's comfortable. Yeah, Everyone wow. else wants rain. It started to rain again. Wow. So said the Rebbe. Yeah. Well, what happened in the second fila? The second fila, Chanina Mendoisa asked for rain, even though he didn't need rain. It wasn't his, but was kasha himself, from right? himself. Else. Kasha from somewhere else. Uh. So you could say over here that since Eretz Yisrael and and and, and, and Bavel, that was the Iker of Klal Yisrael. Eretz Yisrael also. Uh. The seasons we do are like Eretz Yisrael, just they start Zayin Cheshem, we do a little later, but Barach the same, not like in the Southern Hemisphere, it's Legamri the other way. So the Maisa says the Rebbe, so their, their Bakasha is a Bakasha for Roi Ve'olam. Even though by them, it doesn't apply, but their Bakasha is for Roi Ve'olam. 
Lamaisa, by the way, you asked the Shaila ben Negea ben Eretz Yisrael that come to Chutz Laretz, as well as the Shailas ben Chutz Laretz that go to Eretz Yisrael. Very common, people are traveling back and forth. Okay. We're having a Kinnas HaShulchim soon, and the Shulchim are going to come in, and I believe it's before we start saying Vesein Talamater. And they're saying Vesein Talamater already. So what should they do when they come here, when they go back, when we go there? So how are we supposed to be knowing? You know, you have like Yonta Sheni Shagali, so what do you do in this situation? So Lamaisa, we have your Machleikis Achreinim, there is the pre Chodesh or the Ime and those that are with him, and the whole hold that you. It depends whether you're in Daiti Lachsen. You come if a Bnei Eretz Yisrael comes here, if Daiti Lachsen, your plan is to go back soon. Do then Yisrael. you have to do Bnei Eretz Yisrael. What if you take the Yomud? And and if you if you're planning and staying here for a long time, for for a year or two. Then it depends if you have a, I think this is what he, I think this is how he words it, it depends whether you have a family in Eretz Yisrael. If you have family in Eretz Yisrael, continue being sure like Eretz Yisrael, you know, you have family there, so you're, concer- you're concerned for your family, daven for your family, Shavrein. But if you don't have family in Eretz Yisrael, then you don't have, you don't have any interest anymore in Eretz Yisrael, you're not Daiti Lachsar, you know, family there, so you know you Chutzlar. That's the Shita. And also, Bnei Chutzlar, it's the same thing, he comes to Eretz Yisrael like, like Chutzlar. I it think they say, if you got to answer you like just start word. saying it already. When you, when you continue, oh. when you come so the back, chida, the chida is Berke Yosef uh, and a few of his farim. The chida clearly says that we, he does, we don't hold of the pre And that's the Haskam HaSachreinim. We don't hold the pre The Haskam is that, no, we're shoyal in every place, what you need in that spot. Nice. Where you are. Yeah. Where you are. Where you are. Where you are. So, B'nai Yisrael, come here. They, they should be shoyal like, like here. We got out to That's my rope. Now, however, it's Nisha Dei Pashit. If it's before Zion Cheshul, let's make a step back, a step back. Step back, everybody say. No, no conclusions yet. If it's before Zion Cheshvin, and a Benet Benet Yisrael comes here, and it turns Zion Cheshvin while he's here, someone asked me to Shiloh this year, he should do like Chutzlarts. But if he started in Eretz Yisrael, and when he comes here, he should be Mamshech. If he started saying the same Talmud al since Be'etzim Zayin Cheshven is Azman already, he could start. So when he comes to Chutzlart, he should continue. He could, yeah, should continue. Yeah, but but if, he's a, if he's a Shliach Tzibur, and he's quiet Shemun Esrei, he should be sure he saying Talmud. Like Eretz Yisrael. Like Eretz Yisrael. Because after that, he already started. Keep it But when he's by the Chazar Sashat, he's the Chazar Sashat, the Shliach of a Tzibur, say the same Bracha. Wait, now what happens if a Ben Chutzlar goes to Eretz Yisrael? Same thing. If he goes there after Zayin Cheshvin, he ha- and he has to start being shy like the Minigam Makim because you go always like the Makim. Except in a case where you start and er- someone in Eretz Yisrael started already Zayin Cheshvin there and comes here, then you don't stop. Mm-hmm. But in general, the Klal is you go like the Makim. So the Ben Chutzlar goes to Eretz Yisrael, he starts to be shy. So what happens when he comes back? He's being he ma- he's Mamshech to be shy. Yeah. So you have to help Cheshbin. Those business lights that are traveling back and forth. Words, that's a higher madrega. You have to be, keep Cheshbin. Right, right. it's, it's already, you know, listen, from Zayn Cheshbin on, really, you could start being Be'etzim, Shoyal, and, 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 we, and it's just that we're following Bavel, but Be'etzim, our country, you could already start early, earlier asking. It's only Lamaisa because of the Skabla Svarazu. So really, Be'etzim, once you start, you don't stop. But if you didn't start, you don't begin. You go like wherever you are. We don't say, ah, you're here now, Zayn Cheshvin, follow to Yisrael. No, here you are, so you're here. By the way, the Rebbe himself one time brought up, someone asked the Rebbe the Shaila, and the Rebbe answered like, like this, that, you know, the scum of the Achreinim is to go like the Perki Yosef, not like the Pri Chodesh and, and those other Achreinim. However, the Rebbe wrote in a, in a, in a parenthesis that he, by him it's a Tzorich Iyum Gadol, because he feels that a Yois, you are... You're, you, she, he says that really even the, that's, you should be shoyal in, in Shemayat field. The, the halacha is that a yachid, if people find themselves, if, if, like we say, the halacha is that you always go like Bnei Babel, Samach after the Tukufa. But what happens if you're in a country that needs rain? South America. Right, you want rain. You can ask for rain in Shemayat field. A yachid, a yachid. Can ask for rain in Shemei feel a person of Akasha. To ask him in Berchas Hashanim, the Seitel Matzvah, that you can't. But if you need rain, 
And Shemei Tfila, you could say the same Talmud. There's a straw in case it's really a drought. They have a special Tfila that everybody says. Yeah. So the Maisa says the Rebbe, since Yechidim could say him Shemei Tfila, so why shouldn't we say this person from Eretz Yisrael who, who, who came before Zion Cheshvan here? We say he goes like the Minigamokim, why don't we tell him Shemei Tfila? Shemei Tfila, you could say the same Talmud. He can ask privately as a Yachid. And that's not going to be an issue. There's no problem for him asking the same Talmud. Well, Maisa, Abur, this is the, the Minig. Now, let's take a look at this Din that we were, we were saying now about Yechidim. Let's go back to the paragraph, Avo Mekoymis. Avo Mekoymis, Hatzrich and Gsham in Meisachama. Those places that need rain during the summer. Right, like southern hemisphere, the ain and the kroyim eretz b'fneiatzma, they aren't their own country. If they're their own country, the Rebbe, the, the Alter Rebbe here did not yet get to the halacha that we don't pass in like the rush, the rush is svara that in the southern hemisphere every country that needs rain in the summer should should be shoyel the same talamater. He didn't yet say that that that's the that 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 we, we don't pass in that way. So we're going to that svara. And he should say the same Talmud Lavracha in those Mekoymists that need it. But what happens if it's a place that's not a, a land for itself? Ain and the Kroyim Eretz without. So they don't have a, a proper name of being a land. It's an island, it's a, it's a little place, it's not. So then, Ki Yechidim Dami. They're compared to Yechidim, not like a Tzibur. It's only as an Eretz, even according to the Rush, it says an Yemois HaChamo. Those places that need Kshamim and Yemay Sachama should ask Yemay Sachama. He says, even them, it's only when you have a land, it's an entire land. But when it's a small mockim, then like Yechidim. V'shoyelim b'shemei atfileh, shu mockim she'elas kol tzrach ha'shaladim. Because that's this place where everyone can ask the personal request. You have a personal request. This town, it's a town, it's not an Eretz, it's not a whole land. So you're like a Yachid. So that town should ask in Shemei Tefillah. Just because they themselves need personally rain, but now let's change the Shini of the Bracha. You're not to ask for rain at a time where for most of the world it's damaging, they don't want rain. If they made a mistake and they asked the Bracha Hashanim, you have to go back that made a mistake go back to the host of Benesra yeah you made a mistake in the davening you weren't supposed to say that even in every yachid can only ask him when he davens privately for himself we'll do Tanesim in those countries, we'll do Slichis, Mizmoyim, Tehillim, Psukim, Shamater, say Psukim that discuss Mater. You now officially change that Tzibur. That's when it's not an Eretz. Even Lefi the Rush. But remember, we don't even hold like the Rush Bechlal. But even like the Rush, he says only a full, an entire country, an entire land can make a change. But not Yechidim and not even places that don't have status of being on Eretz for souls. Those places who need should say in Shemei HaTfila, in their Tfila Belachash. But not to change what the majority of the world says in Baruch Aleinu. So the Ingen Alocha we said in Eskabel Svarazu, let's finish off the Sif. Go to Meir Shekar Nog Me Eilu Chotus Yisrael. We don't go like the Sfar of the Rush. The Minig is in the, all around the whole entire the, the diaspora. Shabachutz Lord Leilech Acher Bnei Babel. We go after Bnei Babel sixty days after the day of the Tkufa of Tishrei. Alufizem Eretz Aches. You find a certain land. Tzricha Lekshama Meisacham. And during the summertime they need rain. I feel a rach for Sidai. Maybe it's a huge land. Come yeah. like, Ashkenaz like the, like Germany, the lands of Ashkenaz. Yeah. Germany, yeah. Poland, Russia, those lands. Yeah. The lands of Sfard, Spain and those lands. Even a bunch of lands that are big. Together. Still we don't hold like the Rush Lapoil. 
Ki yichidim heim. They're all like yichidim on b'shemei atfila. They can only be shoyal in shemei atfila. Mikol mokim. In Eretz Achas Kul, if you have an entire land, this is in the Gea, by the way, you live in the southern hemisphere. You make a Tzri Cholomot Mezuchama. They need rain in our summertime, right? When it's our summertime, it's yeah, their yeah. winter. Betah by Yochid. There are many gays, like we said, the many gays, they, they say like us. They say during their, during the summer, yeah, during our say. summer, is there what? they say, they, but they're still yeah, saying yeah. the same bracha. But what happens is they made a mistake, someone made a mistake, the Tabai Yochid, the Shalomat of Hashem, he said the same Talamat, he made a mistake. Like those Bachem. Those Bachem, right? Yeah. Excellent. Yuch, Yach, Lismech, Al Svar, Azubit, the Evid. They can be Soymech on the Svar of the Rosh, but the Evid. The Rosh is Svar strong enough that we should rely on it, but the Evid. Meaning, Mechui of Lachser. You have Mechui to daven over again. Even though we don't hold like the Rosh. But since there is a svar of the rush, it's a very strong svara, and we don't really understand exactly why we don't hold of the rush. But we know that halachically speaking, we totally negate the svar. It wasn't the scabble anywhere to do like the rush. But after we came, we could rely on if they make a mistake. If in Australia someone makes a mistake, no. and during the during their during our summer, they said the same talmud matul of racha, it's okay. But yeah, you don't have to go back again. Ellen writes a last of spalat fills and terrors of You want to daven again? Do a terrors and dava. Oh, that is a chiyuv. Like right. you bring a carbon and dava. So you bring an extra tefillah to Hashem. Daven again. Uh-huh. And by the way, very important for us, as we, we after the parentheses, who are dinim baratzis elu ta yachos shamat zayim chesh veelachim chayim lats. So very important. In our country, in our countries as well. After Zion Cheshwin, if someone over here, one of us makes a mistake said and says the same Talamater, you don't need to go back over Shemun Because also over here, Be'etzim, our country is a country which we need rain earlier. The winter season is earlier. We don't, we wait till 60 days afterwards because we follow Bavel. Just by us, it's not such a big gap, it's not such a difference like Australia and Southern Hemisphere, it's Mamish, the Gamri, the opposite seasons. But by us, we're off by a month or two, whatever, from B'nai Bavl. So therefore, Ba'etzem, from Zayin Cheshven and on, is a Zmanak Shaman. Because that's when Eretz Yisrael the Shoyal. So if over here, someone makes a mistake and says the same Talamotter between Zayin Cheshven and December 4th and 5th, it's okay, you don't have to be Chayzer. Some of the Svarit, what we have in the Shabbos Tekish Manasseh, if he said out the Chayinai, I mean, obviously, he shouldn't say Baruch HaTashem, he remembers, but if, doesn't it say, if he did, he shouldn't feel bad about it or something? What is the yeah. question? And, yeah. and by the way, usually when you say so a feel of a Torah's Nadava, the halacha is that when you, we, we say, we daven, Shabbos Menchemayr is connected the Karbonis, Right? But if you want to dab in an extra tefillah, so it's considered like you brought a carbon nadava. You're allowed to bring the davas, darim the davas. You're allowed to bring extra carbonis, make a dava to the base of mixture in the carbon. So you're allowed to also dab in again as an adava, but not as a. But the din is by a tefillah which is an adava, tefillah is an adava. You have to mechadish. You have to mechadish in shmanasre. You have to say new new tefillah in the bracha. So the Maisa, when it comes to saying a, a when it comes to such situations like this, yeah. when Be'etzem you were Yoitza, it's only if you want, you could have it at Tfilos Nadava, so then you don't have to, the, the, the din of Tfilos Nadava is to mechadish something, you don't have to mechadish something. Because you're saying it, you have a certain reason why you want to say it. The, reason, no why to, the reason why you have to mechadish something in Tfilos Nadava is because why are you davening again? 